you know, in an ideal world, that lubricant is performing the function to reduce the contact between the rolling elements. Something that uh, you know we could spend a lot of time discussing. But at this point, where the rolling element is, uh, let's just say, contacting the inner race, and the same up here, oh, sorry, on the outer race, and same up here on the inner race, um, there are tremendous forces because right at that point there, right at that point the uh, the lubricant is holding the rolling element away from the metal of the outer race. It is under tremendous pressure. In fact, the, the metal can deform because of that load and the lubricant actually acts as a solid right at that point to keep those surfaces apart. If we were to travel right down and look as closely as we could at that point of contact as we're doing here in the animation, that those relatively those moving surfaces um, are being held apart by the lubricant. The surface of the metal, while it may seem smooth to the eye, uh, microscopically there are all sorts of uh, um, uh, lumps and bumps and troughs and so on, as you can see here. Um, and the point is, the lubricant has to keep those those uh, aspirations apart. So if it's not doing that then of course then there is wear.